Now, in your news on your Friday evening, a victim is shot, beaten, and burned to death. A young man's brutalized body was found in South Philadelphia, and now police are searching for his killer. The full story from Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo. He's outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters in Spring Garden. Matt? Yuki, police here tell us that a couple of kids made the disturbing discovery of that young man's body. Tonight, his family is demanding answers. I just hope they find out who did this. This is what I want to know. Lou DeCero of South Philadelphia remembers his 25 year old son, Frankie, as a devoted Eagles fan who had always been close with his family. Everybody loved that kid. He was said, Dad, you want to go out to eat? Come on, let's go. I mean, you couldn't get a better son than that. But his son went missing in late April, so his family posted flyers with his photo on it around the neighborhood. Days later, DeCero's family found his vehicle abandoned on the 2800 block of South 13th Street. DeCero remained missing, but then this past Wednesday afternoon, police were called to 31st and Tasker Streets, where some kids told officers they found a body between some bushes. The victim was identified as Francis DeCero. 25 years old, this is not fair. Police say his body was found with multiple gunshot wounds, including a graze wound to his face. He also had burn marks, a stab wound, and police say there were signs he had been beaten. I have to know who did this. There was no reason. Police add that initial reports of a possible robbery motive turned out to be unfounded. Meantime, DeCero's family wants justice. I don't know who wanted to do this. I hope they find him. So much pain there with that family. Now, police tell us there have been no arrests at this point, but anyone with information is urged to contact detectives. Live outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Matt, thank you for that.